The James Webb Space Telescope has made an impossible encounter in space possible. With its golden observation mirrors, the Super Telescope, located deep in space, has now been able to capture the most distant rays of light. The unexpected discovery has astonished scientists and once again triggered a heated debate. We must now examine new models of cosmology and acknowledge that time and space, as we have imagined them, never existed. The James Webb Space Telescope has made another discovery that is reverberating through the scientific world like a cosmic hammer blow. Deep in the universe, Webb encountered structures so bizarre and contradictory that even the best astrophysicists of our time are baffled. What began as a routine observation is increasingly turning into a cosmological test of strength. Galaxies that are far too young for their maturity, light patterns that violate known laws of physics, and a space-time that apparently does not behave the same everywhere. In its unprecedented mission, Webb has not only provided us with new images, but also revealed new dimensions of reality. The story of cosmic time bubbles begins at the intersection of the old and the new. Webb was only supposed to provide a glimpse into the earliest moments after the Big Bang. It was built to capture the faint red glow of the first stars and galaxies, light that has been traveling for over 13 billion years. But instead of finding a chaotic cosmic nursery, it encountered something completely different. Enormous, complex galaxies that existed at a time when, according to all current theories, little more than a few scattered stars should have been shining. The universe loves to surprise us. For centuries, astronomers have been trying to bring order to the chaos of the cosmos, using formulas, models, and telescopes to describe the sheer power and hitherto infinite size of the universe. Time and again, they succeed in enlarging the picture and making it even clearer. And yet, events continue to occur that shake all certainties. We can no longer deny the new reality. The old concepts of time and space are obsolete, and we are entering a new era of science. Webb and his mission There was a lot of nervousness when the James Webb Space Telescope was launched into space aboard an Ariane 5 rocket in December 2021. 30 years of development and a budget of nearly $10 billion embarked on a 1.5 million kilometer journey. After countless technical hurdles, exploding costs, and occasional protests against alleged waste of money, failure would have been a disaster. But everything worked. After a clean launch, the high-tech telescope unfolded precisely and flawlessly in space. Webb began its work at the so-called Lagrange Point L2, a cosmic balance point behind Earth and protected from sunlight. A gigantic five-layer sunshield, as large as a tennis court, perfectly shields the 6.5-meter mirror, allowing Webb to observe the universe almost completely free of light interference. Unlike Hubble, Webb operates in the infrared range. This light is invisible to our eyes, but it reveals the secrets of the early cosmos. Due to the expansion of the universe, the light from distant galaxies is shifted into the red, and this is exactly what Webb can record with unparalleled sensitivity. Infrared light also penetrates dense clouds of cosmic dust with ease, allowing Webb to peer into previously inaccessible corners of the universe. Where Hubble saw only blurry points of light, Webb now reveals entire structures, brilliant spiral arms, glowing star clusters, and colorful gas clouds. Its first images made it immediately clear that this telescope not only sees deeper, but also more precisely than anything before it. What scientists hoped to find was clear. A universe young in stars, barely developed, transitioning from the Dark Ages to the era of matter. The first star clusters and gigantic Population 3 supergiants would have confirmed all theories, but Webb is showing us something else. And this is where the strictly planned scientific mission ends and the adventure begins. Since the start of the mission, Webb has been overturning one theory after another, Nothing is turning out as expected, and many young scientists are jubilant. We could finally be standing at the gateway to the long-sought real truth. If we believe the latest explanatory models, our cosmos is far more variable and wilder than we previously thought. Webb finds a universe of contradictions. What Webb revealed in its first few months was disturbing. 
Galaxies that, according to our models, take billions of years to mature, appeared fully formed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Stars that actually need time to form were shining in regions that seemed far too young for them. These observations not only contradict expectations, they blow them out of the water. Scientists who cling to old theories are missing the reality. And while some are still trying to package new truths in old theories, others are already much further ahead. Completely new questions arise. Have we misunderstood time? Or is matter something completely different than previously assumed? If the universe produced complex structures in its earliest moments, then something is wrong with our understanding of cosmic material evolution. Webb not only shows us what is out there, but also how differently time can pass there. Perhaps time is not a steady stream, but a woven pattern of local rhythms, distortions, and jumps. Such ideas seem fantastical, but there were already indications of the uneven nature of the universe before Webb. Examples include shifts in the expansion rate and the impossible observations that existed even before the Webb era. Webb's images show further evidence that we are not looking at a universe that has developed linearly. It seems as if some regions are further along and time passes differently in others. These time bubbles could also be zones in which physical conditions have developed differently or exist as variations of our known forces and quantities. What scientists initially see as an impossible contradiction could in fact be evidence of a deeper structure of the universe that will change our entire worldview forever. Cosmic Time Bubbles and Alternative Realities What if time does not pass at the same rate everywhere? Physics is expandable and changeable, and the universe consists of many landscapes, regions, and age segments. Can we ever understand such a cosmos? Yes, say some scientists. We just have to study it differently and apply different scales. If certain regions of the early universe existed in so-called time bubbles, zones in which space-time was stretched or compressed, then we should be able to find and describe the transitions to these regions. This requires new research, but it is possible. At the same time, finding such thresholds in the cosmos would tell us more about the actual structure of the whole. You can think of it a bit like different sections within a forest. In one area, there are ancient oak trees with some smaller shrubs and bushes, and adjacent to this is a beech grove with younger trees and completely different vegetation. In the universe, nature could be similar. If a researcher looks into the forest and expects linear structures and uniform, predictable vegetation everywhere, they could be making a fatal mistake. Einstein has already shown that space and time are not fixed quantities. Gravity can bend, stretch, and compress space-time. In extreme cases, such as near black holes or in the inflationary phase of the early universe, these effects could manifest themselves so strongly that entire regions exist in a different rhythm. The speculation goes even further. Perhaps there is not just one universal time, but several cycles that exist side by side. The universe would then not be a uniform rhythm, but a cosmic orchestra of overlapping structures of time, matter, and force. If this is true, we would have to rethink not only our models of space-time, but also our very conception of reality. Exotic Physics, Black Holes, Inflation, and the Holographic Universe It sounds like pure science fiction, but it's true. Even scientists now consider black holes to be the secret cosmic architects. It's possible that the universe originated in a black hole that is or was part of another universe. This black hole could have spewed out matter like a giant 3D printer, and the birth of a new universe would be something like recycling the information consumed from the other world. Giant black holes could also be the creators of time bubble spaces. It sounds crazy, but the fact is that our old explanations no longer work. Of course, this would also mean that inflation, as we have imagined it so far, does not exist. The idea of a homogeneous universe that expanded extremely rapidly in one piece in the first fractions of a second after a uniform moment of origin could be obsolete. If black holes are the secret creators, each one could create its own expansion, and these reality factors could spill out matter not uniformly, but in bursts. This would create bubbles, spaces, and varied cosmic landscapes with different structures, degrees of development, and time systems. 
What is particularly exciting is that these ideas coincide in a fascinating way with facts from quantum physics, and that they could point the way to the unification of theories and disciplines. Let's go one step further and look at the idea of a holographic universe. This theory states that our three-dimensional reality is a projection of a two-dimensional information structure, similar to a hologram. If this is true, the anomalies discovered by the James Webb Telescope could not be physical disturbances, but glitches in the code, indications that we can only observe the projection itself, but never the source. The scientific impact of these new ideas is enormous. The impossible suddenly becomes possible, and it's no longer a matter of fine-tuning existing models, but of revolutionizing our view of the world. If we live in a hologram, the probability of intelligent creation also increases. Webb discovers traces of life in the cosmic blueprint. The magical all-rounder Webb is not only turning our cosmology upside down, but is now also presenting the first indications that our existence is woven into the fundamental structures of the universe. Particularly twisted light patterns observed in certain spectra exhibit what is known as chirality. These are mirror image molecules that function similarly to our left and right hands. This handedness is a central feature of biological molecules. Amino acids, the building blocks of life, occur almost exclusively in a specific chiral form. Why this is so is one of the great mysteries of biochemistry, and Webb is on the trail of solving this mystery. The fact that similar asymmetrical light patterns have been observed in the early universe could be an indication that this preference is not random, but deeply embedded in the cosmic blueprint. This means that life was woven into the blueprint from the very beginning, and that our existence, as well as that of other possible worlds, is not a coincidence, but intentional. If chirality already existed in the early universe, this would be an indication that the universe had a direction from the beginning, not only spatially, but also structurally, and perhaps even biologically. Life would then be a kind of consequence of a simple asymmetrical basic structure, and here again, the suspicion arises that this perfection did not arise by chance. Subscribe to the channel now. The best videos are yet to come.